All right, I'm here with junior safety Alpha Jalo on the Liberty Flames football team. Alpha, how are you doing today? I'm doing well. How are you doing? I'm doing well. Uh, entering this season, you know, there's a lot of question marks about this defense. Uh, what's the progression you've seen over the last several games uh, for you guys? There has been a lot of question marks, but I believe the progression we've shown that our young guys have talent and they're physical. And also, we've shown that we are a very athletic defense uh, in the back end and and on the D-line as well. You guys had put together some pretty good games, uh, specifically the Montana game. Mm -hmm. uh, how big of a game was that for you guys? Uh, the Montana game, that was a, at least, I mean, like we know that they beat North Dakota State, a uh, four-time defending champion. And for us to beat them, that beat them, I mean, uh, it shows that we can play with the top talents or the best teams in our conference. And you guys last week went into uh, Southern Illinois uh, took a pretty bad loss, but a few positives that you guys could take out of the game. For instance, yeah. you had a very acrobatic interception. Just take yeah. us back through that play. What was going on through your head at that moment in time? Uh, I mean, as my coach stated, I, I had an assignment to do, and my assignment was complete, so I had no work. And I saw that, I mean, it's just basically off the game plan. I, saw, I knew that they had some double pass going on, and I saw the running back come out the backfield off a delay of run, and just went over there, and the ball was in the air, and I had to make a play on it to give the off offense a chance to get points on the board. And looking forward to uh, your second FBS opponent on the schedule, Georgia State. How exciting is it for you guys to play another FBS school, and how exciting is it to finally get to play in a dome? Yeah, I never played in a dome before. It's very exciting to play in a dome. Playing against an FBS school, we know they got a lot of talent. Their backup is going to have a lot of talent. so. I mean, just a show on film to scouts for guys who have opportunity to play in the NFL that we can hang with FBS schools, even though we're FCS school. But I mean, it shows that we can uh, hang with guys and we showcase our talent to bigger colleges. And moving on off that point, you know, what can you say of your head coach, Turner Gill? I mean, he's really, really turned this program around. What can you say he's done so well with you guys that has really helped you guys succeed uh, this season? Uh, coach Gill, he is a great coach. I mean, love the guy. He, he wants us to. He, he wants to. He wants to win. He co he loves to win. He wants us to be a family and stick together and do the right thing on and off the field. Even though it's a cliche for a lot of programs, but he, he really wants us to do the right thing on and off the field and wants us to play together as a family. Coming off that successful season last season, a very memorable season. What are you guys' expectations moving forward this season? Our expectations, number one, is winning the conference championship. Number two is going to the playoffs, beating, beating uh, quality and uh, tough opponents. And, I mean, the, the main goal is winning the national championship. Alpha, I appreciate your time, and uh, good luck to you the rest of the season. Thank you.